everyone. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time, welcome. If you have been here before, welcome back. So today I'm going to talk to you about this、uh, infamous fruit. It's called durian. The durian. The people who love it loves it so much, and the people who hate it cannot even stand in the same room with it. It's very spiky. The New York Times described it as the world's smelliest fruit. Flashback two years ago, it was also summer, June, July ish.、Uh, it was during season, and、uh, I happened to be in Singapore, so I tag along with my friends. We drove from Singapore all the way to Malaysia, and then we、uh, visited this durian farm during the durian season. And then for me, a durian lover, it was kind of a dream come true. So not only I got to visit. Like where this durian fruit coming from, but also I got to taste the freshest durian, like straight right from the tree. So that was such a treat for me. So anyway, all the clips were taken two years ago, but today I finally get time to put them together. I want to show you the experience, what it looked like when you actually visit a durian farm. If you like my video, please give me a thumb up and please make sure to subscribe to my channel. This will help my channel to grow. Thank you. Durian grows mostly in Southeast Asia, particularly in Malaysia and Thailand, among which Malaysia grows the best durian. Well, at least that's what my friends told me. 2018 July, which happened to be the durian season, I met with a few friends. We crossed the border from Singapore to Malaysia, and we visited a durian farm. It is one of the busiest border crossings in the region, with 350,000 travelers daily. Please be sure to watch to the end because I will tell you where you can buy this fruit in the United States. If you are brave enough, try it out yourself. The farm we are heading to is called the Zhongchen Durian Farm. It's just one hour drive once cross the border from Singapore to Malaysia. The road turned into bumpy dirt road for the last one kilometer or so. The road has become very bumpy, and we were driving a sedan. If you do have an SUV, I would recommend you driving the farm with the SUV because it will be a bit easy for you to drive, and of course, it will be better for your car as well. The durian trees at this farm are about 20 to 30 years old. There are about 200 trees in the 10-acre farm. They are known of durian types called Green Dragon, Batu, D13. D101 and a golden phoenix. The harvested durians are collected and sold direct to walk-in customers. If you are planning to go in for the durians, it would be the best if you could make the call beforehand, just to make sure it won't be sold out before you arrive. Here in Malaysia, farm owners put fishing nets under the trees. To collect the mature fruit without risk damaging them on the ground, I also heard that one can only wait for durian mature by itself, and for done only that way, the fruit would taste the best. The durians fall in the nights and are collected in the mornings. A typical durian tree can bear fruit after four or five years. The durian fruit can hang from any branch. And matures roughly three months after pollination. The day when we came in, the owner had a lot of green dragons left. That was the first time I tried a green dragon. Inside its dangerous-looking husk is pale yellow and tastes sweet and creamy, almost like a custard filling, or creamy ice cream, I would say. With a hint of bitterness at the end, it's not overly sweet, 
Although it contains mostly sugar, I really like this type. <音樂><音樂><音樂><音樂><音樂> 对，拿篮子。老板会评会会会分嘛？OK，他分了，看我们要吃什么再讲。他这是分一人一一点啊。好吧，啊，分挺早的。应该。去闻一下就知道了。Each type of durian tastes slightly different. Some is a little bit sweeter, some is a little bit bitter. For me personally, I like the bitter ones because they make the fruit more flavorful and also add that extra kick into the end so that the sweetness is not overpowering. It's just like you're having a good cup of tea after a big meal. At the end of the day, we ate a full belly of the deal rings and we packed even more to go home because we know that in Singapore, deal rings are sold at a higher price. I will be putting Zhongchen Durian Farm's address down below, so next time if you are around, you can go visit them and try the fresh Durian straight from the tree. And of course, it has to be Durian season, it usually runs from May to August. Now, if you have watched the whole clip of video, I really appreciate it. Do you want to try it out yourself? Well, if you want to, you can find them in Costco. They have a dried durian snack. I personally think it's pretty good. Or you can buy frozen durian from either H Mart or 99 Ranch. Or if you are nearby Chinatown in uh, New York or Orange County, close to them, maybe you will be lucky enough to find some fresh durians. That's why I heard from my Asian friends. Okay, good luck. Let me know how do you think in the comments below. Oh, one more thing I almost forgot. You might be mixing up jackfruits with durians. I have many friends came to me in the past and said they found a durian in the store, but then, no, that's jackfruit, that's not durian. So here I will show you what are the differences. So first of all, by the looking, jackfruit has these rough pebble shells. It's safe for you to touch and hold this fruit by your bare hands. But for the durians, they have this really sharp spiky shell. You can see that each spike almost like a triangle. So it becomes even very painful and hurt for you to hold this fruit by your bare hands. Second difference is, is jackfruit has this smell that is extremely sweet. For me, it's almost like a very penetrating honey. For the durian, if this is your first time smell it, you might describe it as a rotten onion or blue cheese or maybe the leaking gas. Talking about leaking gas, that was my first impression to Durin. I remember I kept asking his friend that if her gas stove was leaking and she said no. I said, no, you must have gas stove leaking because I smelled it. And at the end, she showed me the Durin. That was the Durin smell. The last difference the jackfruit has these smaller seeds, almost like oversized corn kernels, which you will dig it out and eat. But for the durians, you can see they have these prolonged, bitter seeds. I wish this video spikes your interest. Next time, if you see a durian fruit in the grocery store, would you try it? Please let me know in the comment section down below.